Hi Aquarius, welcome to my channel. This is your reading for the next three months. What do we have for you? A quick message. Message for October. Time for you to take action, Aquarius. It's the month of November. You need to forgive yourself first. Leave your past behind, Aquarius. And for the month of December. Whoops. Enlightenment. You need to affect the connection with the divine. Let's see. Three cards for October. Message for you, Aquarius. Meditation, interesting. You are manifesting a change in your life. Stay focused on what you really want, and it's going to happen. Okay, but you need to believe in yourself, and it's time for you to take action to realize your dream. Okay. The nine of wands. If you are working on a project, Aquarius, don't give up. You are almost there. Okay, stay strong. The sun is coming for you. Abundance. It's also a yes card. If you are asking for something, it's a big yes. Just do it. It's Leo energy. You're going to celebrate something in October. It's a celebration, friendship. It's a nine of wands. King of wands. So you're very confident in your job. You can be talking about you are creating your own business. It's an entrepreneur card here. Stay strong. With the sun, it's the best card in the tower deck. This judgment, you're not the same person, it's a connection with your soul. It's your growing learning about your past mistakes. And now you know what you really want in your life. You're taking action. It's a reverse, a judgment call. You can be talking about something legal also. It's a chariot. It's you taking action to have success, victory in your life. Cancer energy. Let's see. It's going to be a very good month. Aquarius. Like you've been facing difficulties about your money, it was a lot of stress. Robbie's here. Yeah. Just stay strong. Everything will be okay. A contract, a commitment, a proposal coming for you, something official with a ring card. See, so you're celebrating something. It's a lot of money, I feel like, coming for you. Okay, it's about your stability. Let's see. For the month of November, we have forgiveness. You need to forgive yourself first, okay? Letting go of previous stress. Something is changing in your life, Aquarius. Can you talk about your very feeling very sensitive? what's going on for you in November you need to be more patient with yourself if you are working on a project it's going to pay off your sales are growing okay so for yourself take a break 
a pause. It's about healing. So for you for a deep rest in November. Healing and forgiveness about the situation. There is a connection also coming for you, Aquarius. With the two of cups, it's like a soulmate connection. A lot of attraction between you two. This person is very different from you. Can be talking about you're going to date someone here. Let's see. With the seven of pentacles. It's a period of transition. You are moving in calm waters. You can be talking about you're going to move to travel. Okay? It's like you don't want to fight anymore. You are choosing your own happiness. Finding peace in your life. It's a four thoughts. We have the Six of Pentacles. It's like you're going to receive a gift, an offer from someone. It's also time for you to open your heart to receive, okay? It's equal give and take balance coming in your life. With the Two of Cups, it's a connection or a partnership. Oops, the test cards. It's a transformation in your life. Something is going to end for better. For you are dealing with a Scorpio. Let's see. What's going on here? In November, you are making an important change here. Oops. Have the moon card. Trust in your intuition. It's also talking about success in business, your reputation. Yeah, but keep trying. The sun is coming in your life. It's a new light, a new opportunity. Whoops. Let's see. It's a cat. Okay. You're someone very independent. You need your own space. Aquarius. We as a cat can be talking about a friend of yours is going to help you. You can trust this person. It's fidelity, friendship, long-term commitment here, yeah. partnership. And for the month of December, we have enlightenment. So connection with the divine is about your job. Let's see what's going on here. Take you on the right path. Talking about a new idea. Let's see. It's a sure Aquarius. It's a very positive reading coming for you. We have the King of Wands. Okay. We have the King of Wands why showing up in your reading. I really feel like it's about your job. It's your board. Confident. Assertive. You're making plans for the future. You've been dreaming a lot. Whereas the page of wands is like you're choosing a new direction. You're feeling excited about something. Like you are going to have a new beginning in your life. With the key of wands. With the key of wands. Your friends are with energy. I really feel like it's about your, your job because it's a teacher of life, okay? It's about community, tradition. You need to know that you are an excellent teacher, also Aquarius. Some are very patient. Store energy. It's also my regards, okay? The sun is showing up three times in your reading, Aquarius. It's the same line here. It's very interesting. It's going to be a very good end of the year for you. 
You are making important decisions. You are moving in the right direction. You are not waiting anymore. Taking action. Whereas the Queen of Cups, you are ready to be in a relationship also. Can be looking about someone new is coming for you. You are also very sensitive. Your heart is open. You are someone very generous, Aquarius. Helping others. Let's see what's going on here. Sexual Aquarius. Whoops. Stability here. Yeah. In relationship. About your career. You are not the same person, you can see. If you let someone from your past betray you, was lying, cheating, stealing on you. But you are very strong. You are moving in a new direction, leaving your past behind. Choosing to be happy again, okay? After facing a lot of difficulties. It's the end of a cycle in your life. Scorpio energy. Transformation here. Let's see. Whoops. Like you are dealing with someone very mature. It's like a father figure. Someone very intelligent. With a lot of knowledge. This person is going to help you, support you. The change is coming for you. It's also thinking about moving, traveling, a change of location, okay? healthy man. Feel like this person has a good job, a good situation. Can be talking about the towers. We have got Capricorn. Someone very stable is coming in your life. Aquarius. Let's see a message for you. Abundance is coming for you. It's a confirmation with the sun here. A lot of abundance for you, Aquarius. Let's see an advice. Tower synergy. Release control. I really feel like you are dealing with an important towers here because we have the Hilo fan here. Enlightenment is also the Hilo fan tower synergy. If I feel like this person has Taurus in his chart, okay? Someone very mature, stable, with a good situation. For some of you, you are going to get married with this person. And can you talking about having a child also with a son here, showing up th three times in your reading. It's a new beginning, abundance, okay? Aqualis, this is your reading. Thank you so much for watching and being here. Take care. Bye.